Hello everybody and I'm super excited today. The time has finally come. I'm going to be starting on my trailer. just seen I've been cleaning out in here with the drag grinder it is easy to get in some places in the normal angle grinder so in there is now nice and clean ready now for these to drop in so these are going to go in here and then they're going to be welded in place and then the corner post will actually drop into them so that is what we're going to be doing next on both sides. So we need something to put in as a corner post, the same size. We need to get the bed now level or know how many degrees our level the bed is. So that we can get the corner posts in and upright. With the angle gauge, we're going to make sure that the bed is level. So just put that on underneath, and that there's on zero, pretty much. And I'll just pop it on this side. Okay, and that is three degrees out. So what I'm going to do is get the high lift jack, lift it up, take the bricks and stuff out, and drop the bed down until I can get it level. it is level then what we can do is start getting ready to install the headboard supports in there <clears throat> then 
that will let me have somewhere safe to drop it down so that it is not sitting on the jack. As good as the high lift jacks are, you do have to be extremely careful with them. I set the pace when I'm running I always take what I want and I always give it 100 Don't need a bank, no I'm funded Play the game like it's nothing I'm always thankful for something Don't take for granted, stay humble Now wake up! It's time to look at the enemy Look in the mirror if he is no friend to me It's not working now, maybe it's the chemistry It's time to break up so I can make a better me Better believe in your mind cause it's everything You can mold, shape, find almost anything And the front there says it's correct, so that's fine, we can leave it as that. So the next thing we need to do is make sure we have a piece of metal that is the correct size. So I've got my vernier <coughs> caliper and I've measured a piece of metal that we're going to be using, which is 50mm box. And this box here is the same size, so we're good to use that as a test piece. So what I can do is put that in and we can use that to get it all square so you'd be having a big piece of box sticking up with the box section in place i have got some cardboard which i'm going to use for shims because when i weld it i know it's going to contract and it's going to pull so i don't want it to shrink to the point where i can't get this out and i can't get the piece of box that i'm actually going to use in so I'm just going to pop them in there like that. The next thing that I need to do is get my G clamp in position. I'm potentially going to run out of hands. So what I'm going to do is get the G clamp on it. Now once the G clamp is on, I can then tap it to the correct position. shims squared up a bit better Oops. like so So we need to push the top across a little bit and pull the bottom out. So what I can do, I can get a tack on this corner here and that corner there and then that will let me move the bottom. OK, 
okay so there's always going to be a little bit of wiggle room in these because most of the time we have a pinch bolt through them but as long as i can drop it in and out then i'll be happy with that so i'll get a tack weld on there i've got somewhere clean now for my earth lead to go so i can know i'm going to get a good earth on it release the cheek clamp and we need to get upright this way so what I'm going to do is I'm Ooh. and there we go it's pulled up right that way now so and yeah we can get the bottom welded up so we'll just have a quick look at that we are upright and if we go this way we are also pretty much upright when i take the cardboard out there'll be a bit of um a bit of wriggle room anyway so I'm just gonna leave it in there for a minute while i get the tacks underneath and then we should be good Stop, 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 stop,
crack And if you get in my way, you gonna feel the wrath Gotta say it to my face while he's looking back Mirror breaks after math, when I hate, I attack rubbish and dust and debris are going to fall in there anyway. Um, it is now properly raining so it is time to pack up for today but next time it will be doing the other side so that's going to work really nicely. That's Nice. So that's good. Happy. Job done.